Hi, I'm Randy Mueller, Industrial Controls Engineer with McNaughton McKay Electric Company. Short circuit current ratings can be challenging to determine. All industrial control panels, per the National Electrical Code, are required to be marked with a short circuit current rating, or SCCR. If you're going to determine the SCCR rating for a panel by compiling the individual ratings of each component, this can be especially tedious. Not to mention the rating for the entire panel is going to be limited to the lowest rated component. Luckily, there are high short circuit current ratings for components used in coordination with each other. Rockwell Automation has conducted testing to achieve these high ratings in accordance with UL and IEC requirements. These ratings, along with the bill of material used, can be found online at Rockwell Automation Global SCCR tool. Next, my coworker Megan Williams will walk you through using this tool. I will step you through the Rockwell Global Short Circuit Current Ratings tool. You can utilize this tool to help save time and effort when determining SCCR ratings for power devices. The web-based SCCR tool is a convenient method of providing coordinated high-fault branch circuit solutions of complex branch circuits including, but not limited to, IEC electromechanical starters, soft starters, and component drives. First, navigate to the rockwellautomation.com homepage. Hover over the support tab on the far right in the menu header. A dropdown will appear with several different options. Click on product selection and configuration. This will take you to the product selection and configuration homepage which provides several various selection tools to help you select the right products and develop a bill of materials for your application. Scroll to the bottom of the page under Power and Motion Systems and select Global Short Circuit Current Ratings Tool. From there, you're going to click on Learn More to be routed to the Global SCCR Tool homepage. On this webpage, you will find an overview, access to the SCCR tool, as well as supporting documentation. Scroll down and click on Access the Global SCCR Tool. You'll then be prompted to complete a form before accessing the tool. I've already done this, so I will click Download Now at the bottom of the page. The SCCR Tool will pop up on the screen and you are ready to begin configuration. Start by selecting the product category. You will do this by clicking the Choose button underneath your selection. A window will appear with all the various options. Simply select whichever option suits your application. Walk through the rest of the selection. The application parameter selection process is based on common voltage and frequency, the short circuit current rating fault level requirements, including the types of protection devices, whether that be fuses or circuit breakers, and the level of short circuit coordination, always targeting IEC type 2. Once you are done, you have the option to hit accept, reset the fields, or request SCCR data if the information required is not pre-populating. When you click accept, you will see links appear for the one-line bill of materials and test summary letters. These documents can be viewed, printed, or downloaded as a PDF for future reference and to help in the development of panel bill of materials, the quoting process, engineering and documentation stages, as well as inclusion to equipment drawing packages. When you click on the link under SCCR table reference number, a new window will appear. This will include a schematic drawing, all of the technical data pertinent to your selection, as well as the associated part numbers. You can also click on the test summary letter, and this will provide the technical data and tests performed. And you can feel free to view, print, or download that as necessary. And there you have it, a coordinated SCCR rating with just a few clicks. For additional questions or more videos like this, please call us or visit our website.